Wow, that is one heck of a... That was a chemtrail, right? Yeah, it was real, them real skinny ones a minute ago. Well, about 45 minutes ago, they were just little dotted lines. That is one big chemtrail. And then there's the other one mixing in with it. I see blue behind it. But that right there. Really, one big chemtrail. Peace, guys. Actually, we had two planes, and I didn't come out here and film them doing this earlier today. Kenny gave me the heads up that I should come out here and look at these planes, and it's like, I hear them, I hear them, I don't want to see it. So, it's like this big thing that just stretches probably from, I don't know, all the way across Washington State or this part. If the funny thing is, I'll show you. It's not really funny, but if you guys can see this. They sprayed us. I didn't catch it on film. Now I'm going to go in and show you something. Hold on, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm going to show you the, the, the date and the time. It is the 10th of July. And now I'll come over here and show you. It's on the radar what they sprayed and it was a spray and I should have got out there and captured it when they were spraying it let me go out a little bit check that out you can see it looks like they started over the Pacific Ocean and then it goes right over me I live right above this up here, kind of in the hills, they call them the foothills of the Olympics, and there's the spray that they sprayed over us. It's kind of weird. Just thought I'd share that with you guys. And this goes all the way up here into neighbor Kanatistan, so I don't know what the heck they're doing. Anyway, peace and love, you guys. I wish I'd have caught the airplane next time. I'll go out there and do that. Anyway, love you guys. Peace.